massacre started on the 10th of October 1946, the day of Kojigari Lakshmi Puja. It continued unabated for about a week. Over 5,000 Hindus were killed, more than 300,000 forced to convert. Thousands of Hindu women were raped. Leading up to the partition of India in 1947, pressure was used to force hands, kill Hindus, and push for a separate state. This was the Noah Kali massacre of 1946. Over 100,000 Hindus were displaced. Miss Muriel Lister wrote, Worst of all was the plight of women. Several of them had to watch their husbands being murdered and then be forcibly converted and married to some of those responsible for their death. The eating of beef and declaration of allegiance has been forced upon many thousands as the price of their lives. Amrita Bazar Patrika on the 23rd of October 1946 wrote, For the 13th day today, about 120 villages remained besieged by hooligans, most of them who have been without food for the last few days. In an area of just 200 square miles, the inhabitants were surrounded by riotous mobs and massacred, their houses burnt, womenfolk carried away, thousands forcibly converted. Thousands at a time attacked villages, forcing Hindus to slaughter their cattle and eat. All places of worship in affected villages had been desecrated. District authorities took no step to prevent it. It was reported 300 women were mass raped at a single location, 400 at another. This history is gruesome, no doubt. It is important for Hindus to know the atrocities against Hindus to recognize the threat to Sanatana Hindu Dharma. This is not to condone violence against others, but to highlight the need to align to the original strengths and spiritual truths of Sanatana Hindu Dharma, to go beyond the limitations of human life and provide the best of the best to everyone. All Hindus need to be properly educated about the strength of the Vedas Agamas and need the right introduction to themselves as favorite inheritors of the cosmic truths responsible to live the spiritual strengths of Sanatana Hindu Dharma and enrich all other traditions with the conscious sciences. This is a tradition worth saving. The planet depends on enlightenment sciences. Attacks on Sanatana Hindu Dharma need to be clearly exposed to prevent them from continuing and to encourage dedication to the original spiritual truths. If you feel responsibility is a power, you make your life successful.